lot of these products I'm showing you guys work with sensitive skin. Also, guys, I am doing a shoe collection video very, very soon. If you haven't checked out my 2019 shoe collection video, go check that out. You know your girl got some new kicks. <laughs> YouTube and welcome back to another episode on the Nani Show. So if you're a returning subscriber, hey blue babies. If you're new to my channel, what is up? Hello, my name is Nani. And if you would like to be the first to see my newest videos, don't forget to click that bell. Before I get into the video, I just want to first start off by saying I hope everyone is being safe. Social distancing has a good mind through everything that's going on. It's been a lot. I know on a lot of people. I want to send my prayers to everyone that's going through a tough time during this pandemic. I know that's not a lot, just basically me saying over camera, but I do wish everyone well and I hope everyone is staying safe. I know it's been a while. I always say that every time I get off YouTube for a long time, I come back and say it's been a long time since I made a video, and yes, it has been. But today I came to you guys with a girl talk. I had to do some restocking on a lot of my hygiene products that I use and I got a lot of stuff so I basically was like why not do a haul. Some of the stuff is not all gonna be hygiene but I'm just gonna basically show you guys what I picked up and just give you guys some reviews on some of the stuff. Not everything I use on a daily but I did see some stuff that other people recommended and I did pick it up. So sometimes, so some of the things I won't have a, like a review on, but I'll just basically be letting you guys know like it's my first time and maybe I'll come back and let you guys know about it. Maybe not, depending on how it goes. Before we get any further into the video, guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're new, don't forget to hit that bell so you can become a part of Blue Babies. Without further ado, let's get into my spring 2020 hygiene haul. The first thing I'm going to start with is my face. A few of the products I didn't have to go back out and buy because I still had a lot of it. So if you see things that's half empty, that's why. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys is this aloe vera gel. I've been using this on my face for a long time now. And I basically use it to help with moisture. I don't know if my camera's getting it. I basically use it to help with moisture in my face. Um, I have really dry skin, so this actually helps a ton. Um, it doesn't really like do anything to your face, so it's never broken me out. Um, I don't think it's really harmful to the skin, even if you have sensitive skin, because I do have very sensitive skin. So even if you have sensitive skin, I don't think it's harmful to the skin. And yeah, I would definitely recommend this. It's definitely a 10 out of 10. The next thing um, is this Cetaphil lotion. I use this on a daily. I use this basically also moisture. It's uh, for extra dry skin. Like I said before, my skin is very dry, so I do need to make sure it is moisturized. Um, as you guys can see, my skin is kind of clearing up. I kind of still have a couple dark marks, but this has been a lifesaver. I've been using it for almost a month now, and it's really helped clear up my skin. Um, and keep my face really moisturized so I won't have to continuously put on lotion, you know, throughout the day. Now, the next thing I use on my face is this. This is called Pan Ox Oil. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but this is what I use. Um, like I said before, I was going through a bad breakout phase and I usually get prescribed Ben's oil from my doctor. Well, my insurance basically stopped covering it, so I had to take another route and this basically has benzoyl in it and it's basically an acne wash and this i would definitely recommend this is definitely a 20 out of 10 and it's really good for your skin it's really good for sensitive skin i don't use it every single day i'll use it every other day morning and night um and that's helped tremendously dark spots um acne everything like these spots on my face used to be a lot darker but thanks to this it's really helped it's um this is one of the new ones. I still have a bottle that I haven't used. I mean, that I've been using. I haven't used this one yet. It's actually lasted me a long time. I didn't think that it would last me that long, so I bought two boxes. It wasn't that expensive. Um, I got it from Target, and yeah. You can also get it online at Amazon, but I needed it then and there, so I did a pickup at Target, basically. 
so yeah this is really good definitely recommend definitely a 20 out of 10 it's amazing these cotton rounds um i use these to wipe um basically like excess stuff off my face so i'll use it with this witch hazel which brings me to the witch hazel this witch hazel i got this from walmart you can use any witch hazel that is really is good for your skin everybody's skin is different every witch hazel does not work the same so do not listen to what anybody tells you and when they tell you every witch hazel works the same no it doesn't um this witch hazel has worked great for me i've tried the thyers i think that's what it's called witch hazel and that broke me out really really bad i've tried um uh an off-brand witch hazel that didn't work for me this is the only witch hazel that works for me so basically what i do before i clean my face is i will wipe it with this witch hazel and i'll use these cotton rounds um i got these from the dollar tree so you can get them for a dollar the dollar tree this witch hazel definitely a 10 out of 10. next thing i got is this i got this from the dollar tree um now this basically has the all your essentials on it so like the q-tips the cotton balls and then another side of the cotton round now this i would leave in my purse you know just in case i need it when i'm outside because i'm not going to bring my whole q-tip container my whole cotton rounds cotton balls all that stuff if i need something while i'm outside you can put this easily in your purse and it would make life a lot easier and it doesn't really matter what you use it for sometimes i use the q-tips to even out the lining of when i put my lip gloss on my chapstick anything so this is a really good pickup. I got this from the Dollar Tree. It's only one dollar. The next thing I got is this Crest toothpaste. I never heard of a charcoal toothpaste from Crest. I was like, no, I don't want to use it. Did I start using it? I started to get in tune with it more. It helps um, tremendously to remove like stains on your teeth, plaque, it keeps them white. This is a really good toothpaste. I would definitely recommend this to whoever. Um, and it doesn't even taste bad, to be honest. I thought it was gonna taste disgusting just because of, um, I've tried other charcoal toothpastes and they're just, they just taste terrible in my mouth. So that's why I wasn't really comfortable with it until I actually tried this one and it was amazing. So yeah, guys, I would definitely recommend this. The next thing I got is a new toothbrush. Now I got this toothbrush because I change my toothbrush every three months well the toothbrush head because i have another electronic toothbrush but i changed the head every three months and basically it's been like the toothbrush is over with now i don't have any more replacement heads so i just went and bought a new toothbrush um the old toothbrush i had it was cool like i liked it i got that from walmart it was an electronic toothbrush but i just wanted a new one and i went to walmart and i actually got this toothbrush and my favorite color is pink so i picked up this one so basically it's uh electronic toothbrush it has a built-in timer two brushes mode and it's not as loud as regular um electronic toothbrushes now it did also come with just one the only bad thing about it only came with one replacement head so i'll just have to keep going out and buying more but i think or actually two sorry two came in this pack so i'll just have to keep going out and getting more but i actually did get the heads five dollars off they were i want to say nine dollars at walmart so that wasn't a bad steal a bad deal but yeah and it's rechargeable so yeah i got these from walmart get in tune i think the toothbrush was only fifty dollars so that's not bad for electronic toothbrush a lot of electronic toothbrushes are like a hundred and fifty i know this one toothbrush that i seen was like 180 something dollars i don't know about all that but i got me a good toothbrush for fifty dollars so now we're going to move down to like the body portion and like um soaps and fragrances and stuff like that so my first um body lotion i got is the nivea cherry blossom and java oil lotion now i never used this but i did watch a video a girl did um i wish i knew her name i would have put it in here but um, she had put this in her video and she was like, it smells really good and it works really good. Now, when I smelled it, it smells super good. I'm super excited to try it. Um, only because cherry blossom smells amazing. Like I have cherry blossom perfumes and I love the scent of them. I know this won't dry my skin out only because I've used Nivea lotion before and it's pretty good to me. So yeah, 
I've seen it, she recommended it, so I got it and I'm very excited to try it. <laughs> Next thing I got was this Shea Vanilla Body Lotion. Now I've used this before, I haven't used it in a while, only because I couldn't find it for a very, very long time. But then I seen the store, I was like, oh, I gotta get it. This lotion smells amazing. Like, um, I usually put it on right when I get out the shower and it keeps you smelling good, like, all day. I've been looking for it for a long time and I couldn't find it, but I did find it in Walmart and I think it was, I think $8, maybe $5. It probably wasn't even that much. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So you guys should get into it and definitely, definitely try it. <laughs> Next, I have baby oil gel now this is i never use the gel but i know i use baby oil right after i shave so my legs my arms right after i shave i always put on baby oil only because it helps lock in moisture and it also helps to prevent like razor bumps um ingrowns stuff like that so i use it and i like it a lot this one is the aloe and um vitamin e infused kind let me try to get it to focus. I don't know, but yeah, this is the aloe and vitamin E kind. They have um, they have the original kind, but I just love aloe. Yeah, that's why I got it because I love aloe. <laughs> Next, I have this Shea Sugar Scrub. Now, this has been very, very popular among the female community. I have not tried it yet, but I am so excited to try it. It smells phenomenal. And when I seen it, I was like, oh, I gotta pick it up. They had so many flavors. <sighs> they had so many flavors, but this one smelled the best to me. And I didn't want to get too many flavors just in case it didn't really work good with my skin. I'm super, super excited to try this. I might come back with a review video on it only because it's so popular. I think this was like the last one in Walmart. That's how popular it was. But, well, the last one on this flavor. But yeah, smells super good. I'm super, super excited to try it, guys. And I might come back with a review video to let you guys know how it works. But I'm sure it'll probably be a 10 out of 10 the way everyone's recommending that. <laughs> the next one is this Dove deodorant. Now, I only used this once so far. This is my first time ever picking up this deodorant. Now, it's a clear deodorant, so it goes on clear. So basically what it does is it doesn't leave the white marks, the white powders that you guys, when us girls put on our shirts, and sometimes the white powder gets on a black shirt. Yeah, this basically helps prevent it. I haven't put on a black shirt yet to see if it's true or not, but it smells good. For um, fragrance, I recommend definitely 10 out of 10. And you know, some people's deodorant lasts all day but some people's don't. This is definitely 24 hours. You will not have to apply this more than once a day. You can apply this once and be fresh all day, ladies. Let me tell you that. If you're having any issues there, definitely recommend. <laughs> Next, I have this Dove Body Wash. Now, this is pomegranate. They have new flavors out right now. I never actually use this flavor, but it does smell super good. I usually use the sensitive skin kind. Um, now the only thing I would recommend with this one is I wouldn't use it on your downstairs area only because it is scented. So I'm not a doctor, so you don't have to listen to me. Just do what you do. But my doctor told me it's not good to add scents to your downstairs area, period. So basically I use the Sensitive Skin Dove body wash and that's what I use in my downstairs area. This I will use on any other parts of my body. I'm super excited to try this and it definitely smells good fragrance wise. It smells super good. Whew. It smells super good, so I know, like, Dove products are always good to me. So I know I won't have no issue with this. But again, guys, I would not recommend using this on your downstairs area at all. Just heads up. Next, I have this Dove bubble bath. Now, I know you guys are pro probably wondering why I have this bubble bath, but. I like to take baths, depending on how my day went. Maybe I had a long day, maybe I just want to relax with a glass of wine. Sometimes I want a bubble bath. So um, for a while I was using bubble bath I found at Walmart, but it was like a fragrancy kind, but that didn't really work off my skin. So I tried to find a good one, and I seen this Dove one, and this one is mango, mango and almost, blah, 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 blah. mango and almond scent, okay? now. I don't know how this is gonna react, like how my body's gonna react to this, but I hope it reacts good because this smells 
amazing and i'm super super excited to use it especially since it's dove dove has worked wonders with my skin and i'm very appreciative of that because i do like i said before i know i keep saying it but i do have sensitive skin so a lot of these products i'm showing you guys work with sensitive skin i'm really excited to try this if you guys see it you guys should go pick it up and try it too next i have these body cleansing wipes now i got these from the dollar tree they have 15 in them and they're individually wrapped. So this is what they look like. And basically I stick these wipes in my bag. They're, they're not scented, so they're, that's good. I stick these in my bag so maybe like I'm going, I'm outside and I don't, I'm not comfortable using the tissue at wherever I'm at and I want to use a wipe, I can use a wipe. My doctor said wipes are, are better for your downstairs area than actual tissue, depending on how rough the tissue is, the count on the tissue, like just certain things that goes on with tissue. So um, I actually asked her about these wipes and she said they're all cool. They're actually secret. So they are name brand and you can get them at the Dollar Tree. That's exactly what I got in the Dollar Tree. I definitely recommend 10 out of 10. They're great. And yeah, they keep you clean. Hello. <laughs> and next I have this perfume I found. Now, I, a lot of people sleep on Walmart perfumes. Let me tell you that. I love Walmart perfumes. This is called Picnic Breeze and it smells amazing. I cannot wait to use it. I also, I have um, other Walmart perfumes. I have the Coconut Hibiscus one. I have the Cherry Blossom one. I have i think it's a red blossom something i don't know but i love me some walmart perfume because they cheap and they smell good still i do enjoy other perfumes from like bath and body works but i don't know walmart perfumes always catch my eye and they're at a good price so you won't have to worry about being like the price being too high they're in your budget girl this right here is actually for your hair this is a leave-in conditioner this is apple cider vinegar and castor oil i've never seen this i'm not gonna lie to you guys i've had my braids in probably a few weeks now and so i haven't had my natural hair out but i knew i would need more leave-in conditioner so i picked this up i usually use the i usually use shea moisture but i usually use the jamaican castor oil infused one but this one has apple cider vinegar castor oil and pea protein I'm super excited to try this. It smells amazing. Let me tell you guys that. It smells so good. It smells so good. I wish you guys smelled through the screen. It smells super good. It looks super good. So I'm super excited to try this once I take my braids out. And I got this from Walmart as well. And last but not least, this is not a hygiene product, but I finally found the color changing cups that I've been looking for. Now, they, these ones have like um, designs on them. If you can see the top, these are basically all the cups. And they basically change colors. So they have these, these are called like Starbucks dupes, I wanna say. And basically you can buy a cup, cups like this from Starbucks, but I'm pretty sure they're like, who knows with Starbucks because they so expensive. But anyway, yes, I finally found these dupes and they are only $4. They come with four straws, four cups, and four tops. And honey, I got these for the summertime because do you know your Megan baby? Do you know your Megan baby? It's a hot girl summer. <laughs> for um, I got these cups for the summertime because maybe I want to put a slushie in here, or maybe I just want to put my insurance in the morning in here. You never know what you use these cups for, but I know I'm going to use them. And they're only $4. You get 4 for $4. That's definitely a good deal. All together, here's the receipt. It's not that long. But all together, it only came up to $116. That's not bad. And I literally got a lot of stuff. Like, I got so much stuff at only $116. And even if you don't want to spend that much, you could just buy the one item. All of this stuff is affordable because it's all from Walmart. I know a lot of people are probably like, well, what if we don't have that kind of money? You can always go to other stores. I'm pretty sure a lot of these stores carry some of this other stuff for a cheaper price. Now, the other stuff I showed you guys like this from the Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree also has a whole lot of cool stuff. Maybe one day I'll do a, like I'll go to Dollar Tree and, do, and pick up some stuff and do a haul for you guys there because I love me the Dollar Tree. 
but for right now this is just some hygiene products that i wanted to show you guys that i use or that i'm interested in using and basically put my girls on to some of the good stuff to keep you smelling good to keep you fresh to keep you that b-i-t-c-h other than that guys thank you so much for tuning in today no i'm not on youtube active all the time but i missed you guys and i was like let me get my lazy butt up and record a video i haven't been doing nothing this quarantine but eating i'm gonna turn into a chipotle because i eat that every day but yeah i be bored in the house and in the house bored if you haven't yet and you're new to my channel don't forget to click that bell to get updated on my newest videos also guys like i said if you're new don't forget to subscribe and just keep a lookout for me you know i'm not always on youtube but i don't always disappear forever <laughs>